there is the new I call this is gonna be a tower jump uh, a neutral jump okay this is a jump with nothing on it okay so here's the different moves a jump with nothing on it there's a walk so when I say walk you're just gonna walk onto the tires right there's a sprint onto the tires okay and there's a sprint jump which you can do just barely moving forward and jumping just sprint and jump at the same time all right sprint jump all right all right and the last thing is a sprint tire jump that you could do right when you hit and jump at the same time you get that extra oomph okay now i have auto mantle on so when i'm jumping on something i'm holding this i'm holding my jump out so i'll auto mantle to anything all right i'm not pressing it I'm just holding it down. Okay. Do I have Riz? I, I used to, but that's why I'm married. Don't have the Riz anymore. You lose the powers once you get married. All right, here we go. Let me show you this first skip. So I'm gonna I'm gonna tell you what kind of jumps I'm doing. Okay. Neutral jump. 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 Now this one right here is a neutral jump and neutral jump, and then you're gonna move a little bit over to the left. To catch that box all neutral jumps no sprint jumps or anything like that neutral jump neutral jump boom on that one you're not even pressing the jump there at all this one you're gonna want to do a sprint jump okay sprint jump boom okay now you're here now there's two different ways to do to go about this okay you could go um, you could literally jump like sprint jump and land on the the warehouse or you could sprint jump right when you hit the anti-grab and go to the log, okay? So we're gonna go ahead and do, I'm gonna do the sprint jump and land on the log, but you have to avoid this tree right here. There's a tree right there you have to avoid. All right, let's see if I get it. Pop the glider, boom. Now you're on the log, okay? So on this log, you're gonna wanna do a sprint jump to hit that tire, okay? You're gonna sprint jump to hit the tire. And you wanna jump when you hit to like right here. Hold down the sprint, keep moving it forward, and remember, when you're in the air, hold down that mantle, and boom, you're there. By now, you should be here in like 28 seconds. If you're here in 28 seconds, then you're doing a really good job. The, the, after the anti-grab, there's a, gl a glider deploy. Jump in here, hold down your space or whatever, your jump button, and you go back up into the air. Don't worry about that. All right, now you're here. These little guys right here are sprint jumps, if you like. You want to do a sprint jump. It will kind of like scoochy, scoochy down. It's, it's all right. Nothing to be worried about. This one, just sprint and walk on this tire. Boom. Same thing with this one. Sprint, just run right into it. Don't jump into it. Here, you can just walk on. No problem. Now, I like going this route. This route is very easy. Boom. The gentle, gentle running, gentle running. Nothing, nothing, nothing too complicated, chat. These things you don't have to jump on. See, you can walk on them. There's a hitbox hit. Boom, now you're here. Now, you could neutral jump, neutral jump, neutral jump up there, right? But I'm gonna sprint jump and catch on to this, this ledge. You could also jump on this side here. Boom, 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 boom. But I'm gonna jump on the back here. Boom, a little bit easier. Don't get any kind of crazy. Now you're here, right? Now you're grooving. Now for here, you could jump over by sprinting, jumping right over the, the bowls. Boom. Now you're looking good, right? You do that, or a safer route will be jumping here on the backside. If you want to get there, right? Now, we're going to get to the tower skip here soon. The tower skip, there's two ways to do it. The way I like to do it is going through the door, right? Is it going through the door? Uh, but the safer way, which is a little bit harder, and these are neutral jumps. You could sprint jump to here. Neutral jump, sprint jump, neutral jump. Here, sprint jump to the middle. Boom. Walk across. Neutral jump right over. Come back around. Now, you could go through there, or you could sprint jump up to the top. But be careful. You want to be in the middle here. Watch out for the gaps. Most mostly that is just for style, right? It's just for style. Here you can sprint through it and run on the right side. You're not gonna fall. Sprint jump. 
All right, now you're here at the skip. This skip will take you from here all the way up this asteroid, all the way past all this to here. So it's a good skip to do. You wanna learn? You wanna learn this skip? And I fail this skip all the time too. So it's not that easy. All right, when you get here, you should jump over. You should jump over. You should jump. You could sprint jump this, but you're not trying to be fans. Okay, now here. You're gonna have to run, sprint, and jump. But as you can see, this board right here is gonna block you. I like jumping it at an angle and then catching it on the left side. And, and it may it may execute this. It may mis-execute this. So it's all about just sprinting and then boom, just hitting it, and then it's kind of like you curve into it. But well, you could run it like that. But the, the timing on this little run is a lot more difficult. So we'll try this real quick, okay? All right, let's see. Run, 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 jump, catch, chill. The only thing you just got to chill. This next one is going to be a sprint jump, sprint jump, boom. Now, this right here, the tricky part right here, is this. This thing, if you try to jump like right up against here, it will knock you off and you'll fall. Now, to get to these both tires, it's just a neutral jump, boom. Boom, and you're gonna catch up there. You want to look down at your feet as much as possible. Okay, ready? This is a neutral jump. That's all it is. Boom, boom, and then look down, catch. Now you're looking good, right? You're almost there. This right here, I it's a sprint jump. So you're gonna have to sprint to the edge of this thing, turn and jump towards the thing, and try not to get squashed in between the wall and the beam, because then that's what will mess you up. All right. And run, run, and then catch. So you always, when you're jumping, just hold down the jump or whatever button, so that way you do that, okay? So now you're here. This tire is going to be a tricky tire. This tire, it could be two ways. You can either jump on it and mantle jump, and it's going to jump you like short, or you can sprint jump and it's going to go a little bit further. Regardless, uh, I like to sprint jump towards this, this one right here. Sprint jump right at it. As you can see, I mantled it. And that's where things get sketchy. All right, walking around. Now, once you get to this point, I used to sprint at it, but they changed the map. You don't have to do that anymore. All you have to do is walk into it and look forward or to your next thing, okay? So we're just gonna, like, not walk into it, run into it. Boom, boom, boom. Now we're good here. This one you wanna sprint at, right? You wanna sprint this one, and you're just gonna land right, right on it. Always have your mental out, and that is how you do the tower skip in a nutshell. Next one is you're gonna hit this right here, and it's gonna send you super duper far to this point right here. If you don't do, you don't try to sprint and hit the anti-grav at the same time. But if you hit the anti-grav at the same time, it will take you further to the ship, and you're, that's where you're gonna be good to go. All right, here we go. Sprint, 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 jump. I didn't do it, but that's okay. If you mess up, just go back. Just head back to the asteroid. I'm trying to do that skip so I could jump and go up directly. And it'll skip everything. But this takes you from like season two up to season six easily. And basically, chat, those are the only two skips in this game. And that's it. And that's all you have to do. Like, uh, other than that, there's there's nothing... There's nothing, like... All right, we'll try again on this. There we go, I got it. Oh, I'm gonna land on this, at least. Okay, so, these wings... These rings are tricky. There's like weird hitboxes here. Uh, you could walk on them. You're gonna have to do a sprint jump to get to them. But this is where you have to hold out your mantle, your jump button, because you're gonna keep mantling and just keep looking toward the ring when you're mantling. Sprint jump across. All right, try to hit the middle here. Your feet can get caught here, but don't panic. Just slowly back up and sprint jump. Boom, try to hit the middle. It wants you to go hoop to hoop, but you didn't have to do that. Now you're a goon guy. Now you're in season five. Here, 
You can do a sprint jump across. Boom. Take your time. Now, one thing I want to teach you is these these things suck. All right. I've fallen off this thing a thousand times at the top. You're gonna want run right up the angle here. You're good to go. All right. And then you can sprint jump. You can, you can take this uh, however speed you want. You can sprint jump. You do all that kind of stuff. It doesn't matter. I like to just chill. The good thing on being on controller is you can do sideway jumps pretty easy. Now when you're from here, you're going to sprint jump and try to hit right over there. Boom. Same thing on this thing. You want to run out of diagonal. Now you're on top of the ship. You're looking good. At this time, if you're speed running, you want to be here like around four minutes. But I'm not speed running. I'm teaching you. I'm teaching you. I'm showing you how to fish. I'm showing you how to fish, chat. I'm teaching you the ways. Now you're up here. You're good to go. Walk across. This is this little thing likes to push you off, so I like to crouch. And you're good. You can be sprinting. You can do whatever you want. There's a door here. Watch out. There's another door here. And now, at this point, you should be around... When you get to the road, like when I'm trying to go as fast as possible, like four minutes. You're like at four minutes or so. I could be up here in four minutes and a half, but making sure I uh, cover all the bases. All right, this road is mad glitchy, okay? Very mad glitchy. If you start like <laughs> be or uh, like bumping around, you want to be sure. So like, not bump is too too hard because you could glitch inside the road. Once it starts going, you just want to make sure you you don't go up a sharp path here. <laughs> once once it starts going, all right, looking good. Again, you should be here. If you're running, speed running, you should be here. I like got five minutes. Five minutes is a is a great time because the rest of it, there's no skips. So the rest of it's all up to you in terms of skill. You could take this as fast as you want or as slow as you want. You automatically get ejected out of there. You can sprint jump, neutral jump, sprint jump this one just to be a little bit safe. And then now here, <clears throat> you want to be looking at this island right here. And try to sprint, and right when you hit the, the, the purple, jump. Jump. If you land here, that's fine. Jump on down. Same thing. Sprint. Look at Kevin. And if you did it right, you could easily do that in one jump, but you could take your time. Do the multiple jumps. This is... I like to sprint, jump through these. Get that momentum. Get that confidence going. Another thing really really bad about these all right the graveyard people take different routes I like to sprint jump off the roof and land on the coffin so sprint jump land on the coffin boom sprint jump land here neutral jump to here neutral jump here neutral jump and neutral jump here you want to be like at here like a 540 basically you run up here. Some people like to go up this way. It doesn't really matter. Just go up the stairs if you want. Now these look scarier than they are, but the trick to them is you'll get used to them, but don't be shameful to take this like super slow. The good thing is, is like these are not, as you can, on, on the graphic settings that I have, you could see the, the hitbox on it. And if you fall, you could always catch yourself by mantling. But know that you're going to mantle back and forth, and that could be treacherous. There's nothing I could teach you about that. That's You just got to do that one. My fastest time is 60 minutes, but I, I'm trying to... Chat wanted me to show them skips. So I'm showing them skips. So here, right here, you could slip down either or. You could kind of save yourself, but if you could look right here in the middle, you see like the, the peak of it. I like to crouch it here. Of course, if you're speed running, you could just jump it. But you just want to do your best and not fall off the sides because you will slip down. Only this one is quite treacherous. And you're good there. 
This one's going to be a neutral jump. Neutral jump, neutral jump, sprint jump. Neutral. Neutral, this box is tricky. Sprint jump if you want. Sprint jump again. You could try to climb up there, but that's a sketchy thing. Neutral jump. Neutral jump. Neutral. Sprint jump. Sprint jump again. And sprint jump. Here. Now you're feeling good. <laughs> you're doing well. Can't go wrong. Neutral jump up this box. The thing about only up and Fortnite is you always want to try to be flush with the box or whatever item you're jumping on. Sometimes in Fortnite you could mantle a corner, but that's where it gets sketchy to me. So you're gonna just jump at this and kind of like curve around, just in case you mantle it. Because if you mantle it, you're gonna you're gonna go up and over it. And sometimes when you mantle it, you gotta look at your feet. If you look forward and you mantle, it'll mantle, it'll propel you up and over. That's a sprint jump. Sorry, you mantle right over it. There are, there is like uh, ten seasons. Neutral jump, neutral jump. Look up here. Hold down your mantle. Now you're looking good. Looking gravy. Feeling good. Now at this moment, if you fall, you're going to fall down to the bottom. But that's okay. These are neutral jumps. Neutral jump. You could sprint jump this if you want, as you can see. The difference between a neutral jump and sprint jump is a neutral jump, you have to get closer to the edge. A sprint jump, you could jump further away. But that momentum sensation kind of feels weird. Now, when you jump to this one, you want to jump to this fat part. If you jump to here, you, you could fall down. So you want to jump to this little, this little thick part here. Boom. Right here. Neutral jumps. All neutral jumps. Walk out to the ledge. I like to sprint jump here because that ledge is thing. Same thing. Ride the ridge. Here's pretty easy. Like this is like the the way to go. Like once you get in here, you're you're like on your the home stretch in my opinion. Now the only sketchy part is the volcano. All right, all these are going to be. Uh, this is a neutral jump. This is going to be a sprint jump. Same thing. Sprint jump. Sprint jump. You see, rather than jump on the bottom side of this, you want to jump on the the big side of this right here. Neutral jump. It's all about finding the angles. The safer angles to jump at. So all these are sprint jumps. I apologize. Sprint jumps. Sprint jumps. This one's a neutral jump, but you may mantle it if you miss. This one's a neutral jump, but like like I said, it could like a like there mantle. And just hold down the jump button as you're approaching it. That's a sprint jump, and you should be good to go. If you over if you over you undershoot it. All right, now here. Neutral jumps. All that was neutral jumps. You want to be careful when you're on top of these little um, parts of the, the map here. These little pokes. You could neutral jump on top of them and take your time. Do not jump on the tree. I made that mistake before. All neutral jumps. And the thing about Fortnite is the crosshair is not where your body is. That's the hard part. I don't even focus on the crosshair. I just look at my character. Everything in Fortnite is even the crosshair chat is never center. The crosshair is not center of the screen. It's like a little, or sorry, the crosshair is center, but your character is not center. So that's where it's like things are kind of get a little sketchy. All right, here we go. Sprint jump off of this. Now this portion here is difficult. If you fall into the lava, you're pretty much done for. But. You don't want to lose the momentum because there's going to be a part where you lose the momentum you cannot do. So I'm going to talk through this. And there's a part where you you most people like to time the jump, but to me that's too difficult. I just run off it and I catch myself with the mantle. All right, let's see if I can do this. All right, you're going to hold down your sprint here. Keep up the momentum. Hold the right side. This is going to be a little jump here. Doesn't matter. Is just telling the 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 map creator jump here sprint jump is telling you that you will take lava damage and it's letting you know it's a it's a game design. All these are little opportunities to know that if you fall in, you fall in. All right, here's the jump that I'm telling you about. It's not necessarily a jump. You're just gonna walk off, look to the right side here, make sure you hold down that mantle and you're good. <laughs> it's sketchy, and that's a sprint jump. It's sketchy, but I've never seen a more guaranteed way to do it than that. 
is just literally sprint off of it because like sometimes the timing's off sometimes you don't have the boost and just literally just run right off of it i've seen people go that way i like going this way so this is a sprint jump neutral jump sprints these could all be sprints i feel comfortable between certain jumps sprint jump 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 neutral jump if you want this rock looks weird but try to jump on the thick part of it all right neutral jump and sprint jump all right now the pirate ship there is a skip to it there is a skip to it if you could sprint and jump off at the same time you don't have to go to the bottom of the ship you could go to the cargo next if you go a little further, you can land on the boxes. So that's what we're going to try to do. And here we go. And bop the glider. Should be hitting this at least this third box. Hold down the mantle. Nope, didn't get it. Come back around. It's all good. So instead, we're going to do the other route. But as you can see, it is possible to hit that. I always hate this route because it's like... It feels sketchy, but it really is not. But as you can see, the time that you save, neutral jump up here, the time that you save is really nice. You can walk on the ropes, you can gritty on the ropes, whatever you feel comfortable with. More style points, you're gritty on it. The same thing on that one mass, you want to be careful as it can hit you. These are sprint jumps, sprint jumps, sprint jumps. This is a weird mantle. Like you're gonna man you're gonna hit this mantle and just gonna hold on. You could sprint jump to this box. You could mantle this box. There's a neutral jump. Another neutral jump. Remember, just hold on the mantle and you'll be good to go. Alright, so now here you're looking good. And then you could just sprint jump your way up to here. Sprint jump, boom, and it's gonna take you right across. Now, all this part is all, like, there's no skips. So this is going to be a neutral jump here. And, you know, take your time. All neutral jumps. And you can't forget that you could turn your, your camera to help angle your character. This is going to be one neutral jump here, and this is going to be a sprint jump. As soon as you get the momentum forward, you can sprint jump. And you could kind of like run up the beam a little bit and just do that. Neutral jump here. Neutral jump there. Neutral jump here. You could uh, sprint jump to this one. Boom. Neutral jump up here. Neutral jump up there. Neutral jump. Now for those of you who don't know what neutral jump is, is you just run and jump. That's neutral. All right. This is going to be a neutral jump here, but I like to sprint jump. Now. For those of you who don't know, this jump is what they call in comp, they're called uh, a booga jump, a side jump. Booga perfected this one where you jump out to the side and you turn and you catch it. Now, when you mantle over, it's going to sometimes mantle the other side. So you're going to look on the other side as well. So you're going to jump over, mantle over, mantle back over. But you want to make sure that you're on the line. So you're going to jump out to the side, hold down the mantle. It's sketchy, but once you get it, you got it. You know what I mean? I'm gonna wait for my my cloud. Now this thing, the the hitbox, is as you can see, you can stand in the middle. Boom. Neutral jump up this one. You want to get as close as you can to over here. You want to look over. And this is kind of like a side jump. I mess this jump up all the time. But once you figure out that you could like run to the middle, you're good to go. All right, now you're getting very close to the end. Uh, sprint jump up here, regular jump up here. Uh, this one you want to sprint jump and make sure you hit the corner up here and then look up where you're heading. But I like doing a neutral jumps a little bit safer because you don't want to go up and over. Sprint jump up here, sprint jump up here, neutral jump. This third one's going to be a little sketchy. But as long as you look down on your feet, you're okay. All right. Now you're at season 10. Now, these bones 
are are mad difficult to do, okay? You just walk into this one. I'm gonna tell you as best as I explain it, you're gonna land on the fat on the fat piece right here. If you land up here, it will slide you down. This is gonna be a neutral jump. Neutral jump. You don't wanna land here. This is gonna be a sprint jump. You wanna land here. It's gonna be a sprint jump. It's gonna be another sprint jump. Sprint jump. Now this one is the worst one. This one looks deceptive. You can land here and you'll fall. If you land back here, you're gonna be okay. So you're gonna do a sprint jump, look at the green, boom, sprint jump, walk across, sprint jump. You just did the one of the hardest parts, just sprint jump right off of here. So now we're looking good. Now we're looking good. Uh, you wanna sprint jump on top of this box, sprint jump on this other box, sprint jumps, look ahead, walk across if you like, neutral jump right here. Now you're looking good, looking very good. These are all neutral jumps if you like. You can do sprint jumps if you like. This one, you want to look down and make sure you hit the front side, like the, the back side of this tire. Like the back side of this tire. Hold out your mantle because you can mantle either the ledge or the toilet. <laughs> I never thought I would say that in my life. All right, you want to jump on back here, jump here, uh, neutral jump in here to up to there. That's a lot easier to do. Don't freak out on here because you might mantle to the top. It's okay. All these are neutral jumps. Neutral jump here, neutral jump here, neutral jump. Good neutral jump here. It's okay to step on the bush. Of course, like I said, up to you. You, you can sprint jump this entire thing if you want to. You can sprint across here if you want to, but be ready to mantle if you fall. Here, I like to jump on top and sprint jump and hit this corner piece right here. Remember, you want to jump on the diagonal. I fell there before. That diagonal's not easy. Now here's like the last greatest test. You're gonna sprint jump down to here. This is the last greatest test that you have here. It could go two ways. <laughs> it could go multiple ways. You could not get the good jump on the second end. You can land between the purple things. But what you want to do is sprint. And when you hit to here, sprint jump off and hold down your sprint and keep looking at the other tires and then you should be okay. I fell here before, but here we go. Sprint, holding it, holding it. We're good, we're good. Okay, we're good. I fell, fell in between here. This is gonna be a neutral jump. You may hit the top, but that's okay. Neutral jump to this side. Sprint jump to this part right here. Neutral jump. Neutral jump to, the, or sprint jump to the roof, I'm sorry. Sprint jump, uh, neutral jump here. And then sprint jump. This one, you want to mantle the top of the throne and then look down at your feet. You're good here. Sprint jump, which is jumping and sprinting at the same time. When you get to here, you're good. Take your time here. This is the very end of the part with no checkpoint. This is going to be a mantle. It's going to feel weird. You're okay. Neutral jump. Neutral jump. Neutral jump. Neutral jump. Neutral jump this one. Neutral jump. And now you hit the checkpoint. You hit the checkpoint. This is where... Things are good. You don't have to worry about anything. Okay? This is going to be a sprint jump across. If you fall, it's all right. You're going to run here and sprint across. All right? You're going to look over here, sprint, jump. On this tire, you're just going to sprint and go up there. Just sprint right at the tire. Keep holding down the sprint. Try to after touch yourself down. Now this one, you're gonna wanna uh, run, and then when you get to this peak, jump, and don't let go of the sprint for nothing, okay? Just keep looking at the tire. It may, it's gonna feel like you're not gonna make it, but just believe in that, and you're gonna keep going to the other one, and you're good to go right here. Now this one is a sprint down to this tire, and you have to jump like at, when you get to that point. So there's like a little bit of a curve, jump, hold down the sprint, Believe you're gonna hit it, boom. Keep looking forward. If your character does that double jump, that means you did it right. Now you're gonna look over here and sprint jump at the very peak. Be careful going over. Pulling out your pickaxe does make you go, go slow. And you can do this right here, sprint, jump. Now this one's weird. 
because you're gonna have to sprint and jump and then you have to jump at this peak and go right over and for those of you that are that are watching someone asked me to show them how to do this so i'm just telling you how i do it so you don't have to watch it's okay uh let's see and this will be great for a youtube video so it's a, it's a win for me uh you're gonna sprint and you're gonna make sure you jump and you look over there sprint and sprint jump there you go boom now this tire is weird i like to sprint at it and you have to come with a lot of momentum because if you come at it and then you like in the air if you come at it and you have some air underneath this tire you're not going to hit over there you're gonna have to like try to run as long as you can and run right at it no jumping or anything boom this is the rest is easy all these tires you don't jump on just sprint on them as fast as you can just sprint on it and look right where you're going sprint no jumping required this one you're gonna wait to this peak right here sprint jump to the end over here it's the same thing sprint jump to here and jump sprint jump this one's the same thing you're gonna look right at the tire you're gonna try to jump at this peak right here and 